Hey y'all, welcome back to Seasons of Yuri. So on today's episode, I will be doing an ear stretching video. Not like, you know, ear stretching, but y'all know what I mean. I will be going to a 14 millimeter today. Hey. <laughs> It's May the 14th. Um, I think the last time I had went up a size, which was the 12 millimeter, was on March the 4th. And y'all, when I tell y'all, I was so patient this time, although it was two months last time, but at the month and a half mark, I felt my ears were, well, I noticed my ears were ready to stretch up to the next size, but I had got my jewelry laid. I ordered some jewelry back in November from off AliExpress, and I didn't get it until late, like, months later so i was kind of enjoying my jewelry or whatever i will be doing a little mini uh try on with the jewelry that i got i got what two four six eight i just want to show y'all first first of all y'all don't pay attention to my breakout like i'm I'm having some issues with my face right now. But anyway, if y'all can see the hole, um, the naked earlobe, whatever. So before I stretch, I will be showing y'all first these little cute little, um, like I don't even know what to call them. I'm just gonna show y'all. I'm not even gonna describe them or nothing like that. Like I said, I got, got them off AliExpress. My hair is ashy as shit. But they so cute though, y'all. Look. Cute, right? <laughs> Let me stop looking crazy. Ooh, it's coming out. Like I said, I noticed at the month and a half mark that my ears were ready to stretch. Like, jewelry just kept falling out in my sleep. When I would be out, the jewelry would fall out. Y'all, my hands are super ashy. Hold up, let me put me some coconut oil. I can't, I can't do this video with ashy hands. I really can't. They too ashy, too ashy. Especially these two fingers for whatever reason. I wash my hands so much, even before Corona started happening, I would wash my hands all the time. And my hands just be raggedy. Anyway, here are a pair of black um plugs or whatever they are cute on to the next i have these cute little rose quartz oh they're just so cute they are the cutest and i'm kind of sad because I, I don't think i wore these i think i put them in for like 10 minutes and i didn't go anywhere so i didn't wear them but look y'all my feelings hurt <laughs> <laughs> because I don't have no that much jewelry for the 14 millimeter only two pair but whatever it's cool though it's cool and then the clear ones I wore these um probably like for two or three days and um I actually like these because you can't tell really that I have anything in it blends in with your skin tone as y'all can see wait is, okay i'm not saying i'm turning too much i'm trying to cover up my acne <laughs> but anyway i love these y'all too cute now these right here although i didn't wear them much but they kind of are a go-to because if you don't want nobody to know you know that you have your ears or have holes or plugs in your ears then wear those then we just went in super easy i mean all the all of them are but this pair for whatever reason now this one okay so the black ones oh i love these two black is my favorite color y'all people be people be like black is not a color it's a hue bitch shut up black is my favorite color like i said these are another pair of um like stone stones with a little different design on them than the other one y'all don't look at my nails because they might look a little dirty because i just got done washing my hair with purple shampoo and it stained my nails so yeah but anyway 
these are cute as well now these it have like a um red undertone and i like this <laughs> let me stop being silly now i'm really sad for real because what am i gonna do now between the black ones and i mean between the gold ones that come with the um ear stretching kit and the two other ones that i have that i purchased from aliexpress i'm shit out of luck now here are another clear pair um now you can tell that you know you have your ears stretched or whatever because it's very noticeable like you can tell it's not the one with the it's not the tunnels or whatever you want to call it so this it wasn't my favorite pair um they say that you save the best for last but i just saved the worst for last i didn't even try to put it in order but anyway these are the last pair and i love blue but i didn't really like these too well they all right but not the cutest okay so enough of that those were eight pair of um tunnels or plugs whatever you want to call it like some people call it both plugs and tunnels but whatever you call it so now what i'm gonna do is guess what y'all stretch to the 14 millimeter i can't wait i'm so excited i know my ears are ready like i said at the month and a half mark they were ready and it's been um actually uh, uh two months and seven days so yeah it's been a uh, nine weeks exactly today since the last time i stretched my ears which is cool but it wasn't really a rush honestly the tapers they're acrylic which people say don't use acrylic but i noticed that acrylic works best for me it might not work for you you might not want to use it because of what a lot of other people say but me i fucks with acrylic tapers okay so now i will clean them off with my alcohol i know a lot of people been at the store looking for alcohol lately and yeah i got me some i got me a gallon it was 25 dollars but i still got me some so let me clean this off really quick these about to go in so smooth like i already know I'm gonna show y'all the difference between the 12 and the 14. Here is the 12 millimeter, and here is the 14. I'm trying to put a side by side. I'm over here tripping. Okay, so it's a big difference. You can't let me let me take the O-ring off so you can see it going in. Okay, the 12 going inside the 14. Okay, a big difference, like I said. And the 14, of course, can't go into 12. What I'm doing now is lubing the taper with um, olive oil. Ah! Now I have to clean that. I'll be back. Okay, so oiling the taper with olive oil and um, my ear. Let me massage that. My ear had got a little irritated um, about three weeks ago because I had the gold um, plug in from the kit. And yeah, that was irritating my ear. Okay, y'all. So here it goes. Oh. Oh, okay. There it goes, there it goes again. <laughs> That's not how that song go, but I just remixed it. I'm always remixing a song. Okay, so on to the next one. Lube it up with olive oil. Now people use, some people use jojoba oil. I used to use jojoba oil, but guess what? I ran out. So I'm using olive oil. <laughs> I think the last time I used olive oil too, and I hadn't went. Y'all, look at this. My finger is like. <laughs> my index finger just went through my ear a little bit. Let me stop before I rip my earlobe. 
Okay, so now my left ear used to give me troubles all the time, but the last time though, it went right in and guess what? It went right in again. I'm just so excited. So now I'm not even about to put the O-rings on. I'm just gonna put the jewelry in right away because I don't feel that I need to wait. So here it goes, y'all. Oh. snap okay oh <laughs> yeah I know I didn't need to wait it went right in and it does not even hurt at all cuz before I stretch to the 12 any other time it will hurt but now that I'm on to the next set of um gauges it doesn't hurt so let me put the o-ring on that before it comes out which I highly doubt it is, but I'm just gonna put it in. Look at that, y'all. Look at that. Look at that. Ooh. Okay. Next. Make sure it's lined up. Y'all, my lips look a little crusty. Don't pay that no attention, though. I did not do that right at all. <laughs> Let me try that again. Okay. That was slippery. It's going in so smooth. All right. There it is. Wait, hold on. Slippery. Uh, Y'all. It's in, but let me just push it. Okay, I don't know what the problem is right now. It doesn't hurt or anything. It's just for whatever reason, it's not going in on one side. Hmm. I don't know why. Okay. All right. Let me see. I thought it was going in. It just keeps sliding right back out. I think because I got a little too much oil on it. But it's going in. Okay. There it is. I was about to say. Like, it's going in, but it's, it's coming right back out. There it goes. Too much oil on my hands. For real. All right, done. Got it in. I don't know why that wouldn't go in with no problem. It was so, well, I know why, cause it was so slippery. All right, y'all, so that's that. This is what it looks like. I'm trying to really cover up this acne, y'all, cause it's bad. Although I know y'all saw some of it, but whatever. Y'all, I'm so excited. I'm in a 14 millimeter. I can't believe it. I don't know what size I'm going to stop at. I said I was thinking about a 16, stopping at the 16. But then I said, I don't know, because the 18 looks like it's just right. I don't know, y'all. Let me know in the comments what size y'all think I should stop at. Like, do y'all think this is a good size? Like, I think this is cute on me. I don't know. I don't see. But I might. I'm not going past 18, though. I know that. I might stop at 18. I might wear 16 for a while. I don't know. But all I know is my year mark is coming up. August is when I started. August 2019 is when I started stretching my ears. And yeah so i think i'll be in the 18 yeah i should be in the 18 by august so we shall see but if not then cool if you know i do get in there by august then great but either way it goes i'm just happy that i haven't suffered from you know any major complications um i did have a blowout once before Whew, i almost fell y'all y'all didn't see that though 
but I did have one little blowout um me trying to rush and everything but just be patient take your time because if you don't then you gonna have some bad complications and you don't want that because them blowouts they not nice they look ugly they hurt and yeah you gotta start all over so or downsize like a size or two but anyway y'all so that wraps up for today's video if you like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up comment and subscribe i would greatly appreciate it until the next ear stretching video